The other big contest in Pennsylvania is the governor's race. After months of campaigning and millions of dollars spent on advertising, voters had their say today. And as you can see, Democrat Josh Shapiro has defeated Doug Mastriano by double, din it, double digits. Shapiro will replace Governor Tom Wolf, whose term is ending this year. Action News reporters Walter Perez and Maggie Kent are following this race. Maggie, let's begin with you live at Josh Shapiro's headquarters at the Convention Center in Oaks, Montgomery County, where I'm sure there is plenty of celebrations tonight. You know, Rick, lots of energy, but no celebration just yet. We're waiting to hear from Attorney General Josh Shapiro. Now we can call him Governor Josh Shapiro and Lieutenant Governor Austin Davis. Davis making history now as ABC has called this race in favor for the Democrats. He would be the first black lieutenant governor elected in the Commonwealth's history. Uh, Shapiro running on a campaign that was focused on moderation, also focused on protecting the rights, voting rights and abortion rights in this case. He out fundraised, he outspent his opponent, Doug Mastriano, and it apparently has made all of the different supporters here talking about the large voter turnout for Shapiro today. Again, we're still waiting to hear from him, to hear from Austin Davis, an air of excitement and confidence here in Oaks. It's where we're live. Maggie Kent, Channel 6, Action News. Rick. All right, Maggie, and of course, we'll go back to you when we hear from the governor-elect. Thank you. Let's switch over to Action News reporter Walter Perez now, who is at Republican Doug Mastriano's election night headquarters in Camp Hill, Pennsylvania. Walter. That's right, Rick. Once again, Josh Shapiro has been projected the winner by ABC News. And quite frankly, it's not really surprising. I mean, there were really two big metrics that told the tale of this race. First, of course, was the polling. Mastriano never led in the polls, even though it tightened a little bit over the past month. And second really was the fundraising with Shapiro dramatically outraising Mastriano. Now, a short time ago, Mastriano did address the crowd. That was before ABC News projected Shapiro the winner. We haven't heard from him since. He may come out a little bit later. But once again, ABC News projecting Josh Shapiro is the winner of the governor's race. Reporting live from Camp Hill, Walter Perez, Channel 6, Action News. Rick?